So today we're going to be looking at Never Be Like You by Flume. If you want to check out my full instrumental for this song, I will leave a link in the description below. So for this track, there's only three chords that we need to know, and they are C major 7, 3rd fret A string, 5th fret D string, 4th fret G string, and 5th fret B string. The second chord is D minor 7, 5th fret A string, 7th fret D string, 5th fret G string, and 6th fret B string. And the 3rd chord is F major 7. 8th fret A string, 10th fret D string, 9th fret G string, and 10th fret B string. So for the intro and verse, we're going to be using finger picking to arpeggiate the chords. And we're going to be using your thumb, first, second and third finger. Now first we need to assign each finger to a string. So first you're going to place your thumb on the A string, your first finger on the D string, your second finger on the G string, and your third finger on the B string. And they can stay in this position throughout the whole song. So we're going to start on the C major 7, and I will play the pattern through slowly first. So the pattern on the strings is A, D, A, B, A, G, A, D and you just play that once. So A, D, A, B, A, G, A, D. And then after that you move on to the D minor 7 and you play exactly the same pattern. and you just play that once. And then after that, you move on to the F major 7, and you play exactly the same pattern, but twice. So that all together. And that's the intro and the verse. Now for the chorus, we're going to be using exactly the same chord progression as the intro and the verse, but we're going to be playing the chords slightly differently. So starting on the C major 7, I'll play through it slowly first. So first, we're going to pick each note of the chord. Starting on the A string, following through to the B string. A, D, G, B. This will then be followed by a slap of the strings. You then pluck the A string, and then pluck the rest of the chord with the other three fingers. 
and then one more final pluck of the A string. So we'll do it again slowly. And you just play that once. You then move on to the D minor 7 and do exactly the same. And again, you just play that once. After that, you move on to the F major 7 and you play exactly the same pattern, but you play it twice. So I'll play that all the way through slowly. and that's the chorus. Now for the bridge, you're going to be using the same finger picking pattern as the intro and verse, and the same chords, just played in a slightly different order. So you're going to start on the F major 7, which you just play through once. You then move to the C major 7, which you just play once and then you move on to the D minor 7 which you play through twice so I'll play through the bridge slowly And that's all you need to know for this track, so I hope you've enjoyed the lesson.